Want to automatically generate and add subtitles to your videos without using any editing tools like the ones you see below? In this video, I'll show you exactly how to do that using Bookily.com's Add Subtitles to a Video feature. We use N8N as our automation platform, and the Bookily app automatically generates and adds subtitles based on the video's audio. You can fully customize how the subtitles look, including font, size, color, position, styles, and much more. This setup is ideal if you want to make your videos more accessible, more engaging, and easier to follow, especially for platforms where videos are often watched without sound, like Instagram Reels, TikTok, or YouTube Shorts. You don't have to build the workflow from scratch. I've placed the workflow JSON file in the video description if you want to import it later. For now, just follow along as I explain each step and why we do it. Let's jump in and build the workflow together step by step. In this example, we keep things simple by storing all input data in a Google Sheet, but feel free to use any service that works with N8N. First, create a new sheet in your Google Drive with the following columns. Row, title, video URL, and bookly URL. Here's what each column is for. Row is a unique identifier for each row. Title is the name of your video. We'll send it to Bookly as the name for the video. Video URL should contain a public, downloadable link to your video file. Bookly URL is where we'll store the link to the final video after Bookly has processed it. This allows us to use it in follow-up workflows if needed. Click on Add First Step, then select the Google Sheets node from the right menu. To trigger the workflow every time we add a new row to the sheet, choose the trigger on row added. For poll times, you can select any mode. Next, select the document and sheet from the lists. In this example, my sheet is called Subtitles. Let's add a new row to the sheet with a row title and video URL. In this case, we're using the video URL generated from a previous video of this playlist. The good thing is, Bookily makes all results easily reusable so you can quickly plug them into new workflows. Back in N8N, click Fetch Test Event to retrieve the data we just added as a new row in our sheet. Great, now that we have all the necessary details from our Google Sheet, we can add the subtitles to our video. Select the Bookily node and the action Add Subtitles to a Video. For the name of the new video, drag and drop the title into the name field. For the video URL, drag and drop the video underscore URL into the video URL input field. Now, let's configure the subtitles. Bookily gives you a lot of control here. You can adjust the font and size, color, word pacing, and placement. It also supports subtitle animations like highlighting the current spoken word or using signal color rotation to attract the viewer's attention. In this example, I select the subtitle style highlight current word and set yellow for the current spoken word. I increase the font size to 24. Make sure to select the correct language that is spoken in your video file. In my case, that's English. Of course, feel free to play around with different styles and colors to match your own content. This is where you can get creative and experiment with different looks. That's done. Next, we'll write the finished video URL created by Bookily back to the Google Sheet. Select the Google Sheets node and the Update Row in Sheet action. Choose the same document and sheet from the first node. For column to watch on, select the column Row. Remove title and video URL from values to update. To be able to write the Bookily URL to the Google Sheet, we need to execute the previous node once. Click on Execute Previous Nodes, then drag and drop the URL from the input into the Bookily URL form field. In the last step, change the input to Google Sheets Trigger and drag and drop the row value into the row form field. Now let's execute the workflow to see it in action. Bookly will process everything and return a finished video link. It will be saved automatically back to your sheet. You can simply click the link in your Google Sheet to view the final video. With everything working, don't forget to enable the workflow so it runs automatically in the future. With the workflow complete, let's switch over to bookly.com and check out the result. Head to the Videos section and click the video to open the Details page. Here you can see all the information for the video and subtitles. Now let's hit play to take a look at the result. You know what I love most about my white poodle? When I'm sad, she curls up right next to me like she knows. It's like having a fluffy little best friend who just gets you. 
And that's it. You've now fully automated the process of generating and adding subtitles to your videos using Bookily and N8N. It's a simple and effective way to increase engagement and accessibility, especially for viewers who scroll with the sound off. In the next video, I'll show you how to clip a video using Bookily's Clip a Video feature, so you can quickly cut highlights or create shorter content for social media. If this video helped, leave a like, subscribe to the channel, and share it with someone working with content at scale. Thanks for watching.